going to modify another SMPS. This SMPS used to power a VGA display through this DC jack. This SMPS has a minor problem which I will show you in a moment. Its normal output voltage is 14 volt 1.43 amps. This SMPS uses TIS TL431 which is a voltage reference IC can be controlled using two resistance only. We can call this a voltage divider. I will replace this voltage divider with a potentiometer so that I can vary its output voltage. Let's turn it on. That's the mains input voltage. Some AC voltage also present in its output. As far as I know this voltage might not harm you but it can harmful for sensitive circuit components. Connecting a earth wire will solve the problem. I am connecting this unused earth wire. Can you guess why this problem arise? After connecting the earth wire there is no AC present in its output. So we solve this problem easily. Now let's check its output voltage which is fixed 14 volt. I draw a simplified schematic of its feedback portion. Here is our voltage reference IC TL431 which is controlled by a voltage divider network. I don't know why they use these two resistance in parallel but we will replace this voltage divider with a potentiometer and we should able to control its output voltage. We have to replace those electrolytic capacitors too. Look at this colorful capacitor. I replace its long output cable with small wires. After replacing these wires, I remove those output capacitors which has a rating of 16 volt 1000 microfarad. I am replacing them with 330 microfarad 50 volt capacitor. You may use higher values. Please don't laugh at my resistance removing strategy. I remove those voltage divider resistances. After removing those resistance, I set the potentiometer such a way that it keeps the same ratio as the voltage divider. After that, somehow I managed to place the potentiometer on the PCB. Then I soldered AC input wire and the earth wire and connect my multimeter to its output wire.
after turning on it should show about 14 volt as i said the potentiometer according to the voltage divider first i try to reduce its output voltage but when i reach about 9 volt it jumps to 13 volt and smps makes some noise then i attach a 20 ohm load and this time i able to reach about 5.7 volts and the same thing happens the voltage jumps to 6.8 then i again mm. increase load and manage to get a minimum of 5.2 volt after that i try to increase the output voltage and this time without any problem I reach to 50 volt 